this, this median function. And this is harder to optimize, to find a single point that, um, that is, is going to decrease the cost of, um, of the, the, the sum of the distances to all points. So there's this weird uh, um, property that if you've got a set of points, um, and, and, and I look at the, at the average here, then if I take all of these, all of these vectors from the point to the average, and I add up these points, it's going to be zero. That's the average. Now, this step has a similar property that instead of looking at, at these vectors, I look at vectors of length one. So all the vectors are the same. Are, yeah, these are all unit vectors. And now I have a slightly different point. That if I look u vectors to this point, these now have to sum up. If these sum up to one, then it optimizes this function. Um, what do you mean sum to one? There's so these, X, you can get these vectors. What? Your x y components. Yeah. If I look at if if I stuck all these, if I translated all these onto onto the origin. Right? And you can, you can think of a vector as a point away from the origin. So right. this one right. I got here, this one here, this one there, and this one uh, like this. If I added all these unit vectors up, then they should, they should sum to zero. They'll, the total amount away from the origin is zero. Um, and so if I do that, then, um, then this is, is, is the, it's called the L1 median. Um, and if I can choose that point, then I can replace that set in here in Lloyd's algorithm, and then this is guaranteed to converge. I'm not going to get this go back and forth. If I if I use the average, or if I use something weird instead here, then then I, I might not be able to do that. Um, so the problem is this is called the. Um, this is called the Fermat Weber problem. Um, that's, that's this right here. And it's known that there's, or it's not known, but it's, uh, there's not known to be a closed form solution to this. You can, what you can do is you can take all the, you can have a gas at the center, take all of these, uh, these vectors, the unit vectors towards it, add them up, and then step in that direction. And this will get you closer, and it will eventually converge to the right thing. Um, but then it's not just one step you can do here. You need to actually iterate inside of this step. But then you can do that, and that will, in some sense, converge. But there's no even combinatorial bound on many steps it will take. So this is much less, less known how to solve the key medium problem exactly. Yeah. And could you, in your iterate, your stepping, could you get high level there? Um, I think it's convex. But the problem is still. I'm almost positive that it's, yeah, uh, the, the problem is still convex, so you won't get caught in a moment now. Um, yeah, you can look at, you're summing up convex cost functions around these uh, milks playing after class. So, so I just want to mention one more thing before we go. There's one more issue with k-means that, that in some spaces, this whole notion of an average of a point of a sum, it, you, you might not be able to do this. Sometimes you have some you have some some distance function, but it's not a Euclidean distance function. If you think of you're in the space of oh, of like shapes or something, or you're in the space of like um, vectors of words, um, you it, it, it may not sense it may not make sense to take this average. Um, so instead of finding like some regular point by this average, you can just go and check. You, can, you say the average must be one of the points in the set. And so then you can just check the, 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 all the points in the set, the one, that, uh, here we are, the one that minimizes this cost function. And then you can use whichever variation, either the median or the means or whichever variant you want, and just find the one that minimizes the set, this distance. This is more expensive to do, but it allows you to go to much more abstract types of data and still do this, um, this assignment-based clustering. Um, and
And so, uh, so you can make it more general by doing that, but you're not going to get as good of a cost if you could pick some point not to the set um, in, in, in general case. Because, um, but it, it makes it more general. So that's another variation on this, on these sorts of problems. Um, yeah, so that's it. So um, remember, no class on Monday. Uh, homework is due on, on uh, next week, Wednesday, and uh, and then the the data collection report on the uh, uh, a week from Monday, and then next Wednesday we'll talk about spectral clustering, so clustering on graphs.